Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. We're gonna make some ice cream today. I love ice cream, but we're not gonna use milk or cream or sugar or egg yolks. No, and they're actually not gonna be edible at all, but they are gonna look really, really pretty and so cute. We're gonna use the Poppet Moldable Clay Light as Air. This is the refill pack that's got all we need to make some little mini ice creams. So let's see what comes in this. We've got three bags of Poppet Clay. So let's open them up and see what colors we get. I find it so much easier if you snip off the top and down the sides and that way you can peel it back. <gasps> Chocolate. Mm -mm. Look at this. That's deliciously milky chocolate and I don't like to waste any of it so I try and get all the bits up off the bag but it's not always that easy. So I might use the scraper. This scraper doesn't come in this set, this comes in one of the starter kits. So if you want the scraper you need a starter kit but it does come in handy for lots and lots of scraping and texturing needs. But you can also do without it, you can use the refill pack without it. So we've got this really light clay. Poppet is really cool. It's a this sort of polymer -y thing. Well, it's not sort of, it is a polymer, but it dries out nice and kind of squishy and firm. And it dries out really quickly. So we need to make sure it goes into these resealable bags that come with the set. Now this is a bit tricky. We might, we rolled it into a nice log there. <laughs> I won't tell you what that, I think that, that looks, looks like. Let's call it delicious chocolate. We're gonna make it into all sorts of yummy chocolatey things. What's our second color of clay? It's, oh, strawberry pink. And don't they just look so creamy? This one's stuck too. Let's scrape this off. Don't like to let any of it get away. There. And it just feels so nice to mold. It's so squishy and soft and light. And we're gonna stick this one in here too. Make sure we slide up the little, the little seal on the top. And the third color that we get to play with is, oh, it's a lovely ivory white. It's kind of an off white. So it's not snowy white, but it's a good color for vanilla. Perfect. Right, so we've got our three colors and they're almost all resealed. They're Three poppity, colorful, delicious clay colors. We'll move them over because we're gonna see what else is in this pack. Oh, very nice. We have got some tasty treats to put on the top of our ice cream creations. There are some strawberries. That's nice and sweet. And oh, look, a chocolate block and a chocolate swizzle stick. There are two of each of these and some raspberries too, two little raspberries. Oh, boysenberries. Are boysenberries that color? And there are also some sprinkles. Let's snip this open and have a look. We'll sprinkle some out on the ground. Look at that. Now, these look like real sprinkles. You cannot eat them. They're made out of plastic. It's all made out of plastic, but they look so delicious and so cute. We'll scrape them out of the way so we can get started now. The fun part here are the 3D molds that you're gonna be sticking this clay into, and squishing it in nice and tight so that we can make some really delicious looking creations. This comes with a good set of 3D shapes and that one's a nice little cutter, the blue one. Oh, we are gonna have so much creative fun with these. All right, move them out of the way because Emma, would you like to choose what base we're going to use first for whatever creation you'd like to make first? So she's got something here. We're not gonna really know what it is until we put our clay in. White clay for this base, and if we roll it into a nice smooth ball, it gets a much better impression. It's nice and flat on the bottom, and we can actually, because it's open on the bottom, we can just pop it out like that. It's a cone, it's a vanilla cone. Look at the little crisscrosses on there. Oh, now where are you off to? Okay, so she's got my water dropper. This doesn't actually come with the set either. This is from the starter kits, but you can just you can just dab water around the edge. Now, why are we dabbing water around the edge? I hear you ask because we are going to endeavor to get some sprinkles around the edge of the cone. You know how they dip the cone in the white chocolate or in the in the you know chocolatey milk chocolate the liquid chocolate and then you put sprinkles on it and it's all really yummy on the top well that's what I'm trying to do I'm really doing a really terrible job the sprinkles are everywhere okay I've done a rubbish job at that let's see if I can <laughs> coax these sprinkles into going where I want them along the rim of the cone <laughs> it's terrible you know what we'll fix it with more sprinkles 
<laughs> more sprinkles. More sprinkles will fix everything. Right, move out of the way other sprinkles that didn't go on where you were supposed to. The sprinkles are misbehaving, Emma. Put them back in the corner. And now we can try another 3D mold and it might be time to put some ice cream on the top. We've got quite a few different ice cream molds. This one's a scoop. This looks cool. Let's make it pink. Mm, strawberry ice cream. And we'll squeeze it out flat. There. It's trying to escape on me, but that's okay. I'm keeping it in there. And that one just fell out by itself. And it looks so delicious. And when we put it on the top, it even makes my sprinkles look good. Well, half decent. That looks so cute. But what are we doing now? <gasps> Chocolate? Are you serious? You want a double scoop cone? Fair enough. Might as well have a double scoop if you can. So a chocolate scoop for the top. We'll mold that on there. And let's see if this one falls out. No, it does not just fall out. Oh yes, it did. I don't need my poppet tool. It just fell out. That's so perfect. We can put it on the top. That's so cool. That looks so, so yummy. That's great, Emma. I love that, that's our first ice cream. We'll put it over here and you can stand next to it. And Andrea, oh, Andrea has an opinion. Really? You think that, oh, hold on, you just fell over. <laughs> stand up. You think that we should put a decoration on the top. Okay, so a raspberry on the top. Actually, I think you're right. I think that makes it look extra specially tasty. And Emma agrees, obviously. Andrea, would you like to choose what we're going to make next? Okay, so we've got a different base here and we're going to put in some pink some pink clay and we're gonna see what this one is it's a little bowl a little bowl for our ice cream that's nice so what sort of ice cream are we gonna have in the top let me see it's gonna be chocolate but what shape is it going to take it is a mystery these girls love to trick me but they're gonna show us all of these different molds it's chocolate and it is well and truly firmly compacted in there. Now that's not just going to fall out. So I'm going to need our poppet tool. This also does not come in the refill pack. So you're going to need a starter pack to have your poppety out poppet tool. There, chocolate swirl. Look, it's a soft serve swirl. And that looks so delicious in that bowl. Oh, yum. That's so very, very, very delicious looking. We'll put some more water on the top and I might try to get some more sprinkles on. Let's see how I go with the sprinkles this time. Are you ready? Wish me luck. <laughs> we'll squish it around. Round, around, around. This is doing a better job. I think I might have uh, been over ambitious with the small surface area. I was trying to get it on with the other cone, but that looks really nice. And on the top, Andrea, a swizzle stick? No. Uh, a strawberry. That is perfect. That is another delicious treat for the Lego friends to sell in the ice cream van. So we'll move it over here. Excellent, Andrea. That is such a lovely, creative, delicious creation. Emma, are you off to decide what we're going to do next? All right, so what have you got? Okay, it's going to be chocolate on the base. Is it going to be the waffle or the bowl? Because there are two, our waffle cone or the bowl are our two choices for bases. We do have some more different ice cream on the top, so we'll have a look. Oh, chocolate cone, very nice. Very, very good decision. And for the top, it looks like we're going to have vanilla. Let's see what shape this one comes out as. You can already see because it's just fallen out here a bit. It's a swirly one too. It looks like a soft serve as well, but a different style. There. Now, I reckon that's pretty firmly impacted in there. We might need our poppet pop it tool to pop a pop a pop it out. Let's see how it goes. And there it is. It looks like a big dollop of whipped cream, but it's a big dollop of delicious vanilla ice cream. Put it on top of the cone, and you know, that looks real tiny, but real. I would eat that. Would you eat that? It looks so good. We should probably start eating it before it starts dripping down the side of the cone. No, we shouldn't because it's not real. Uh, okay, a chocolate block up the side, a stick of chocolate. That looks so nice. And a strawberry. Well, why not? Because it's just plain vanilla. We will dress it up with some really, really tasty toppings. That looks nice. I really like that one. Okay, whose turn? Andrea. 
Let's see what Andrea chooses. Are we going with the bowl again? I think Andrea likes the bowl. We're going to have chocolate. We'll squeeze it in and smooth it off the top. I'm getting pretty good at this. It feels so lovely. The clay is so soft under your fingers. It's not sticky at all till you wet it. If you wet it, it does become sticky. There, that's a much better bowl. I did a better job that time. Very, very crisp on the top. Now, what are we putting in the bowl? Let's see. Oh, excellent. Let's make a mixer so we can we can blend our vanilla and our strawberry. You can twist them around, roll them into a ball. Well, we'll actually not do that. We'll just squeeze them in here. We would get a much better shape if we did roll them into a ball. We're probably going to have some little, some. it's not going to be as smooth as the other ones. Let's have a look and see how it turns out. It is looking very, very nice though. I do like some strawberry and vanilla. Oh, it looks lovely. It looks so, 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 so too tasty. It's all making me really hungry. That's nice. I like the plain scoop. There's a little bit of chocolate escaped onto the, onto the ice cream on the top. And that looks good. I need to stop squashing it though. That looks very, very nice. All right, a bowl, a chocolate bowl with vanilla and strawberry swirl ice cream in it with a chocolate twizzle, squizzle stick, can't say it, twizzler or a squizzle stick. And two of them sticking out of the sides like little ears. And of course, we're gonna need some sprinkles on the top. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Come on, sprinkles, get on there. Don't fail me again. <laughs> sprinkles. Do we need more? I think that's probably enough. Just a delicate sprinkling of sprinkles on the top. That's really good. We've got four of them now. Do you know what? I think we might make one more. Let's make this one a Whopper Chopper ice cream. Are you ready? This one's my turn. <laughs> We're going to have a chocolate cone. Done. Very nice. Move it out of the way. We need a pink, a strawberry scoop of ice cream. And pop that out. One. And we need a vanilla scoop of ice cream. <laughs> mm -mm. That's two. Two scoops of ice cream. I feel like the count on Sesame Street. Two scoops of ice cream. We're on the third one. It's pink. It's strawberry. It's going to be three. Three scoops of ice cream. <laughs> now I'm just being silly. And we're going to go with one more. We're going to go with four, four scoops of ice cream. There's vanilla. <laughs> that one popped everywhere. All right. Are we ready? Are we steady? Let's stack these. Vanilla first, then strawberry. We'll alternate them. We'll make a really pretty pattern. And then vanilla. And strawberry. Look at that. It's enormous. It's bigger than the Lego Friends girls. And on the top, ah, uh, yeah, I think I think we could do with a chocolate block stick up there. <laughs> and no, no, I think that's enough. <laughs> it's starting to bend. <laughs> it's fallen over too. Come on, stay upright. There we are. That's perfect. <laughs> as long as it doesn't fall over again. All right. Ice cream's for sale. It's our hot summer's day by the beach. Who's going to be the first customer? It is Stephanie. Stephanie, would you like an enormous ice cream that is almost bigger than you? Of course you would. There we go. There's Stephanie's choice. Olivia has heard that there's ice cream down here at the beach and she's taking off with one as well. These are huge ice creams for little Lego friends girls. Mia is having my favorite one with the, with the soft serve <laughs> vanilla on the top and Ariel, well, of course, we are at the beach. Which one are you going to have? Hmm, maybe the double scoop. That's good. You go, and, you go and share that with the prince. And the last one who's having it? Well, Elsa. Of course, she needs it for Anna's birthday party. It's perfect. It will make a wonderful centerpiece. Just make sure that those little snogies don't dance all over it. Though they will love it because it's ice cream. <laughs> Well, you've sold out of ice cream, girls. We're going to have to make some more. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and click like. Check out some of my other silly videos and I'm going to be back with a new one very, very soon. Bye.